right guys, it's me and my shadow out here with G-Man Tuna Can today. And uh, got an old permission here that the house got torn down on and we're about to do a little metal detecting on it. Tap. Tax token two one mil, I think. Cool, that's a keeper. Oh, wow. That is a weird discovery for right here. A curry comb. It's a curry comb. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Nugget, no, it's curry comb. A curry comb. Curry Haven't comb. seen one of those come up in a long time, huh? That's crazy. That's that is really cool. For right here. Nice find. Yeah, odd. Twenty two rim fire. There's actually still a signal in that hole with that twenty two shell. piece of iron. I went ahead and dug that iron signal out and it was a screw with a snap bolt with a nut on it. Scrap copper. All right, there's actually something else in with the scrap copper. Still sounds like a nickel. It's another piece of that same piece of metal. G-Man just got a wheat. Sorry for the road nose. We're roid, roid noise. Roid noise. Road noise. We're right up against a highway and a street. And G-Man got a wheat. Hey. 50 something. 50 something? 50 something. Hold it right, chair. All right. Cool. First wheat. I think I've got a wheat signal over there. Get it. Boy, it's muddy right here, huh? Yes, sir. The silver coin laying right there. Just kidding, it's not. <laughs> well, now he 
you made me lose my signal. There it is. That's gonna be a wheat. There's my wheat. You don't see wheat pennies like that too often anymore. Which is a shame too, because that was a great design. Denver Mint. All right, it's after this uh, beaver tail right here. And when I dug the hole, something else came out, which is interesting. A nice, uh, chipped and worked piece of flint or a chert nice little flake there so keep my eyes out for some airhead activity out here on this little lot that's pretty cool Small, huh? You got a coin? <laughs> it's pretty mucky, isn't it? Looks kind of smooth. I think that's going to be a wheat, don't you think? Let it dry up a minute and check. Do what? I have to let it dry up a second and check. Is it? Oh, shield no penny. kidding. Yeah, modern shield. Wow, it's not even corroded yet. Nope. Budweiser. Now this is odd because that's that little plug that I was getting pieces of scrap, uh, broken sca scrap copper out of. I can't talk today. And I came back the other direction and now I've got like a high signal right there. Hitting the upper 80s. This sounds good. See a coin. Nineteen seventy one Memorial. G-Man Tuna Can just walked over a second ago and he also found a little flake. He's kind of
kind of a scratchy zinc penny signal, but I'm going after it anyway. Oh, I see it. It's right there. Ford Memorial. Silver right there. Just in case we get the phone out. I see one cent, you guys. One dive, I mean. Oh boy. I can't see. It's a a barber or a, a seated wash it off real quick boy it's thin I've never found a seated anything before you can get them in our area but they're not as common as Okay, it's gonna be a barber. Look at that, 1910. Beautiful. G-Man just pulled a 46 weed out of this hole and he's got another signal in with it. something down there. 
thought that was going to be something cool. I thought there was a big watch fob or something in there. It's going to be a bottle cap. Hmm. Pull tab. Yep, one that's folded over on itself. That's why they used to call me Tulsa Pool Tab Finder. <laughs> Some kind of hunk of melted or folded copper or brass. I can't tell what the heck that is. Uh oh, I think I see it. Bullet. Nine millimeter. Flat quarter. And it's going to be a stinking zinkin'. It's a pull tab, actually. That's a real nice flake here. Looks like the head of a nail. The memorial penny. All right, G-Man and I have switched locations and uh, he's got permission for these couple houses that are side by side built in 1910 and 1915, about that ballpark. And he was showing me this back porch of the person that used to live in this house, put all kinds of neat stuff in there. And their little sidewalk stones on the back patio. Some Mardi Gras beads and little jewels in that one. Cookie cutters there. This one's got tools and hinges and stuff in it. And this is the coolest one. There's all kinds of little tokens and things in that one. And we think these are actually, three of these are actually sterling silver. That's really cool. That's a little ram's head. It's upside down. Anyway, we're going to detect and see if we find anything. kind of fitting I thought that was a ring for a second it's got kind of a chrome wash on it clad dime state quarter can saw it's a copper pipe big old nail Or cancel. Another piece of that copper tube. Stinking zinking. Memorial. Cloud quarter. Oh, that is a crusty stinking zinking. Yeah. Yeah, you're you're the one doing it. Old uh, G-Man got a something from up north, eh? That's 64. 64. 64. I think it's still frozen, eh? Is that a loony, eh? <laughs> Just gonna send that. That's a big old piece of deep aluminum. I wonder how that Canadian coin got down here. Probably one of those Canadian geese. Oh, sure. Canadian geese probably stole it off of somebody and blew it down here. And you bet. Dropped it down there. Say, or I suppose it could have gotten dropped by the glacier melt, eh? Oh, yeah. Because no. this was all part of Canada. Yeah, this was, uh, 
this was all under ice. I think it's still those darn gooses. I bet you're right. Kind of makes you want to say to him, hey, could you please stop doing that with the coins and stuff? Hey, they're gooses. It'd be real nice of you not to do that anymore. Yeah. Acting like a goof for the day, you think? Yeah, yeah I think so too. Yeah. I'm just making sure so I can end the video here. I'm digging my last signal of the day. It's 82, still in the hole. 83, oh baby. Oh. Now it's back on 82. It's gonna be a clad dime. Womp, womp. Excuse me? Might be getting low on the batteries. Good, a washer. A solid iron slug. That's where the real big video goes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's what they used to use in the half. Thanks for watching, guys. <laughs> oh, yeah. Look where we are! Oh, my God. He's outside his way in Curtis Brothers' lawn. Oh my goodness, and there's the house. Remember when you sat up there, Kylie?